Um, a couple of months back, I got in contact with Joby Kelly, the chairperson of Banisto Town AFC, um, to see if we could set up some sort of a summer programme um, for the people that we support. Um, Joby had previously done a lot of um, fundraising with one of the guys that we support, Patrick Staunton, so that's where the idea kind of came about. Um, the guys here have been fantastic, Joby, Coach, Wayne, um, there's been a good good turnout every week from the coaches here and um, I just hope for the future that you know it, there's, this is the start of a fantastic relationship with the two organisations within the town. Oh, fantastic turnout. Um, there, we have 18 services here in Ballinslow for the Brothers of Charity and there's been representation from most of them here every week. We've had 28 uh, people supported plus staff every week and you know it's been great after being kind of you know being kind of locked up in the pandemic no one's been able to get out anywhere or do anything social so it's been great for everyone to get out and get a bit of fresh air and you know enjoy enjoy the good weather and get a bit of exercise while we're at it well we're hoping um towards the end of the summer to get going again with with Banisloe Town Football Club Joby mentioned that earlier that you know he'd like to link back in with us and you know continue this relationship um down the line as well I love this soccer and attack for Sophie and have it got this for us I love us you got more independence in town here. I know they will have golf, everything like that here. I love that I think I am really happy for everyone keeping work hard and keep pressure on us. Really happy. I really love us. Look, it was absolutely heartwarming. We'd uh, 28 clients here from the Brothers of Charity on a Friday morning. Um, the weather was absolutely brilliant, which played an absolute major part um, because we were outside all the time. We were between AstroTurf and grass pitches over the few weeks. Um, we did a lot of ball work on the ground. We worked with keepers. Um, it, it was, they were well able for it, um, which was absolutely brilliant to see. And I think uh, most of all, I think they enjoyed the five weeks. It was great to see people going home happy after the end of a, a five week programme. It was very, very good. Yeah, absolutely, I think it, it, it shows what we want to do with the community in town of Bandeslo. Um we're on the ground, our facilities are going to be open, but um, we've worked with the Brothers of Charity, go back to the 70 miles. Um, Patrick Staunton really pushed it for us that time, so he did. And we'll be looking to carry this relationship on into the future and just let them know our facilities are always open and that, that goes for everyone within the town of Bandeslaw. Well, what's next for Bandeslaw Town is that we're, gonna, we're tipping on with a summer camp. We had a registration last night, so nationally we've one of the biggest independent summer camps and also We've uh, volunteers within the cl club that's taken the CARA inclusion programme, so that'll help us as well.